Alright, what's up guys? I'm sure uh, most of you guys have already seen this card. Um, that it was pulled in the group break and I luckily had the Lakers. Um, what I'm going to do now is officially put it for sale. I was uh, debating to keep it or not, but I'm really not that rich. So I uh, can't really afford to keep it and also he's not really my PC. Uh, I would love to use some money to buy maybe a Kobe or some more EJ Land cards. So I have to let it let it go for sale for uh, maybe someone who uh, actually collects Kareem or just a uh, bigger Lakers fan than I am I guess um, again this is a one of one this is a championship uh, season logo man and it's a real logo man not one of those uh, tag ones with the full autograph on here this beautiful full autograph um, what else uh, I, I mean and okay so for the championship season I looked it up um, there are a couple of championship season, um, and you guys, if you want, you could probably call Panini for exactly the detail on the logo man. Um, but this should, this is uh, guaranteed from his lo uh, from his championship year. So one of the years that they were championship, and I mean, there's not that many uh, game use uh, jerseys of uh, Kareem the Bull Jabbar around. And if you think about it, he's gonna be around for a while, and. Um, he's going to be down in history for the NBA for the one of the greatest player alive. Um, I think the always going to have the most points scored unless they change up the rules for the NBA or something. But it's just going to be impossible uh, now nowadays to ever beat his score of uh, most points scored. Um, give you guys a closer look. This is one of the only time I take it out of the sleeve. Just a beautiful logo man card. You can see some of the uh, purple or blue around the logo man that I was cut off from and this logo man is probably uh, 20 to 20 to 30 years old uh, not sure I have to look up probably his championship year but just a beautiful card personally pulled by me in our group break live on block TV and on YouTube numbered only one of one um, and the price I'm gonna put on it I was looking for 2400 uh, just cash, but right now I'm gonna lower it just because there's something I really want to buy. Um, I'm gonna lower it to 2100. I already got offer of like 1800. Uh, someone else offered 2000. So I mean, um, I might even go for a little less than 2100, but 2100 will be the buy and out price. Um, if you guys are interested, please let me know. I would love to try to sell it uh, just over YouTube or other forums so I don't have to take it to uh, eBay. Just because, uh, you know, there's so much fees involved if you're selling an item that's like $2,000. So I would be losing a couple hundred dollars. Um, so I would love to sell it uh, just here. So if you guys are interested, please let me know. I could possibly do a card plus a cash deal, but um, the card probably got to be something high-end. Maybe like Kobe Bryant Auto or uh, uh, something high-end that I could either sell or Kobe Bryant that I would actually collect myself. So... Watching the Lakers game right now, and Lakers are doing great. Um, 16 point lead over the Phoenix Sun, wow. So, um, great time to collect some Lakers card. And let me know if there's any hardcore collector that's interested in this card. Again, officially for sale. 2100 buy now, or uh, send me any kind of serious offers. But I do have a couple offers already, like at 1800, uh, 1900. So, please come strong. If you're offering less than 1800, I will not really consider it. So, Please let me know and thank you.